you have reached White Beach Confession. Mm-hmm. Fuck yeah. Do not call this number unless you order for Trump. God damn it. Shut up. I want you to be happy. Fuck you. Shut up. Actually, I'm not a Trump supporter. Shut up. I'm a ruin up. this fucking country. Shut up. Stop breaking my fucking ball. Shut up. Hey, what happened? Like, I don't know who the fuck this is. Why don't you come to my address and say something, motherfucker? Shut up. Stop breaking my fucking ball, fucker. Shut up. Hey, what happened? My wife is in danger now. Hey, what happened? Fucker. Hey, what happened? Fucker. Hurry, man. That's what happened. Shut up. Fucker. I don't know who you are, man. Who is this? Why would you believe any of that? Shut up. I've been Fuck. asleep. Shut up. Since 9.30. Shut up. Well, ma'am, the, the gentleman, he, he's the... Uh, the gentleman? Who is the fucking gentleman? Well, ma'am, ma'am, please bring it down a notch. Don't forget, you gotta get your green card from me, fuck. Huh? Shut up. Happen. All right? What can happen? What the fuck? Who the fuck are you, man? Shut up. Fuck, what kind of car are you looking for, dummy? Dodge Neon. Bring it. Soft, bitch. We ain't got no damn Dodge Neon here, man. What happened? Don't you ever call here again, man. You understand me, bitch? I'll fuck your mother like I'll fucking kill your ass, bitch. You understand me? Try Don't it, you call it. this motherfucker again, man. Bring you your punk out. ass over here, man. Talking that shit. shit. Talking that shit. Bring your ass over here. Three, two, zip. Shut up. Punk. What happened? I'll give you the address, punk. What? Bring your punk ass over here, man. Shut up. Bring yeah, your man. punk ass over here, man. Your your bring your punk ass here, nigga. Shut up. Bring your punk ass here. Is that a trailer Please. Punk? I'm gonna beat the shit out of you and then buy me some lunch and drink off of you, bitch. What happened? Bring your bitch ass here. What happened? Bring your bitch ass here, man. I don't know what happened. Bring your bitch ass here. I just Google Earth that the trailer. Bring your bitch ass here, man. Are you in the trailer? Shut the fuck up. Shut up. Don't call me anymore. Shut up. You should put the phone down your pants to get pleasure from me calling you. Fuck you. Shut up. What happened? It's a green car, sir. It's a green car. Are you ignorant, man? I don't know what a green, green car. Green, you gotta green. tell me what kind of car you talking about, man. Green car. The, the color is green, green, man. Yeah, dummy. I know the color is green. What kind of car, dummy? Shut up. Don't come. Just... Don't call here no more, man. Don't call here no more, man. Shut up. Don't call here no more. You don't call here no more, man. All right. Yeah. What do you want? Hey, what happened? Fuck you. Yo, fuck you, motherfucker, you piece of fucking shit. Shut up. Don't ever call me again, you goddamn cunt. Shut up. Fuck you. Don't, you. you don't call me fuck a cunt. You. you don't call fuck me a cunt. You. Don't call me a cunt. Fuck you. Fuck you. Fuck you, cunt. Shut up. Oh don't God. ever call me again, you piece of fucking shit. Shut up. Can you eat your mother's asshole with that mouth? Oh, I will. I'm not allowed to swear on this line, sir. You motherfucker dick. Cunt, fucking piece of shit. Shut up. I love this country. Shut up. I do love this country. Shut up. I do love this country. Shut up. I do love this country. Shut up. Shut up. Hi. How you doing? Hi. Hi. We need. Oh, why'd you do week? Why? Why'd it get weak like that? Oh, there we go. Oh. No. All right. Hi, everybody. It is, uh, oh, I guess it's the ninth day of March 2024, and we're here to do some call show machines incorporated LLC type shit. Uh, I, I currently have the, the, the chair in lifted mode. Probably will not last long because it's been going into low rider mode uh, without me activating it uh, pretty much since I set up for the show. Uh, but it, it, may, it might stay up all, all like this just to make me a goddamn a liar. Uh, I did not prepare for the show. I was out all day uh, doing some magical things. Um, so I got home about an hour and a half ago and we're just going to wing this shit. We're going to wing it. But uh, give, give me a second. Give me a second. I'm going to go ahead and bring the Skype on. Skype, I am activating. And we're here. I can't yell and we're live because, you know, fucking copyright. You know, he'd probably get me. That guy. He does all the fights. Hello, everybody. Oh, welcome back to Ward Machine. Oh, Sounds like you had like hemorrhoids. Shirt, but... Thank you. Yeah. Oh, it's actually the first time uh, wearing it. I was going to return it because it's a little big. It was a Christmas gift. Um, looks good. 
Yeah, it's about it's about one size too big. Um, it's a it's a little long, a little long. But uh, I I waited too long to return it. I had the receipts and stuff, and I could have taken it back, uh, but I didn't. Um, the All other right. one I got is a lion, a Detroit Lions one, uh, but that one will shrink because it's one hundred percent cotton. This one will not shrink. It's not uh, it's not a shrinkable fabric. But uh, you can wear it when you sleep too, like a night. Oh fuck that! I don't wear <laughs> shirts when I sleep. Fuck that! You see me over here doing shows without shirts on. You think I'm wearing one when I'm just sleeping? I can't believe you're wearing a shirt right now. That was my first thought. No, I don't. I don't do that. No, 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 no. No, I went. I went out today. We uh, went. Uh, what did what did I go do today? Went to, uh, to some thrift stores. Did some thrif- thrifting shopping. Uh, went went to a mall. Walked around a little bit. Got uh, got some other people some pretzels. Not me. I didn't eat pretzels. But uh, and then we um, we went and got some seafood. And had a seafood boil machine, and uh, it was good. Uh, that sounds. I, it was very tasty, very tasty, very good, very good. And uh, I almost fucked up ordering the, like it was gonna be more expensive. And the lady's like, she's like, no, no, more expensive. Do this way, do this way. And uh, so, uh, the lady that was that actually owned the place, so she saved me a couple of dollars. She's like, no, 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 don't do that, don't do that, no. Um, oh, a nice place. Yeah, yeah, Tip yeah. Good. It was the uh, first time being going there, but. Uh, it was it was good, you know. Nothing like a little seafood. It had a little uh, boil. It had uh, we had some, there was some sausage in there. There was green mussels. There was snow crab, and there was shrimp. There was a pound of each, and then some hard say, hard, 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 hard boiled eggs, potatoes, and uh, like you know the half things of corn that they put in there. Hmm, that sounds royal. Yeah, yeah, it was very good. Very good. Do one thing. We not gonna answer, dude. The text now subscriber. Oh, you're a you text are now subscriber. Ooh, you poor. Ew. Fucking gross. <sighs> Fine. Hello. Hi. Uh, I was calling. I was calling. Uh, like, is this Judy? Yeah. Okay. All right. Um, I was ca- I was calling because of the the issue that I'm having with you guys right now with your your yard. Wait a second. What? What are you? My yard. What are you talking about? Yeah, I I live ju- I live just down the way. I'm renting. Yeah. And and I was walking I was walking by and I I noticed an issue. An issue? Yeah, you're right. You're right there on the corner, right? Correct. No. You're not. No. Who are you? My name is Dwight. And how did you get my number? Uh, well, I wrote down the address, and then I, 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 I called the police. I called in a complaint, and they told me who you were. What about what? 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 Uh, you had your chick. You, you, you had no. You had chickens out in, in your yard, and they were clucking and making a lot of. We don't have chickens. I don't, I, I don't know if these I are your have... chickens or not, but I had to call them. What what are you talking about? Where where are you talking okay, about? Okay, you know you know ch- you know chickens, right? Yeah, Gilbert. Yep. Well, I don't live there, and that's not my property. Well, it's that's still assigned under your. I checked the laws, and I checked all the ownings. Well, I don't care. You, I don't care. That still, property was sold last month. It still shows as registered to you, you and him. Well, I don't. I don't even. I don't even own that place. That's not even my house. Well, legally it is. We need you to come clean the chicken shit out of the yard because it's very. It's an eyesore and it's downgrading my property value. What are you talking about? Okay, you know how the I, the, I the cloaca. Well, I don't know if these are your what? chickens or not. I don't even know what you're talking about. Why are you so hysterical? Who let the fuse on your because tampon? I, you're, yeah, I moved. I don't even live there. Okay, did John move too, or is John still there? Are you divorced? What happened? No, we moved. Uh, it's not even our property anymore. Oh, oh, but it's still registered as your property. Well, it's not because it's all the the loan has gone through. The, but I checked the register. I checked the registrar. I don't care what you checked. Okay, you, you're you're not. You don't know what you're talking about. Okay, when are you that gonna, house has been sold. Well, you need to come clean the doo doo caca feces that the chickens you're, left. You're you're full of crap. Hey, hey, I'm hey! I'm not coming. In, I'm not. I'm not going.
go in there to do anything. Well, you're going to get a fine. I'm not allowed on that property you're gonna because get, you're gonna it's get a not fine. my property anymore. You're going to get a fine then. Stupid. Hey, don't call me stupid. Stupid idiot. Stupid. Don't call me stupid. You're stupid. No. And don't call me no, and listen, bother me because I will go call outside. the police on you. Listen, I'm out, I'll go outside right now. I'm just down here. See, look at these. Look at all these chickens. Look at all these chicken. Your chickens all over the place out here. What are you talking about? I, we never had chickens. These are all your chickens. You're full of shit. No, these chickens are full of shit, and that's what I'm complaining about to you. You just don't understand. Hello. Put a man on the phone. What are you talking about? Let me talk to John. You're unreasonable. You're in here. My husband anymore. We've been divorced for years. Okay. I was just taking care of the property, mowing the lawn and stuff. You're you're his, you're in hysterics. What's your what's your where is where is your psychiatrist? Shut up. Hey 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 hey. Are you gonna come clean up there after these Shut chickens? Shut the hell up. Come clean up after these chickens. I don't even know who you are. Where do you live? Is this your cow? Oh, God, this must be a prank. No, I need this clean, ma'am. I'm trying to sell my home, and you're bringing down the value. What home? What home? My home. Wh where do you live? I live over here on 144th Street. Yeah, and which house? On what side? I What the heck? Why are, why are there so many questions? I live on the side opposite of you. Do you know where the house is, where I got the big pole barn out back, and I got some of the... Uh, some of the big heavy equipments. You mean the guy that just moved there? Yeah, that's me. What's, hang on, hang on, I'm having a hard time hearing you. Here, all right, all right. Now, what were you saying? Sorry, the chickens were getting. I I, I was trying to shoo them away. Right across the street from me. Yeah. Well, like I thought you didn't live it. there anymore. Oh, now the truth Shut is coming up, out. You idiot! I'm trying to figure out where you are. You're the guy who just moved in. that paid a million three hundred for the place, ma'am. Right? Yeah. Why? What of it? Okay. All right. Okay. Okay. All right. All right. The house has been sold. Okay, well, are you going to come clean it or what? That's all I'm trying to figure out. Why would I clean it? I'm not allowed on the property anymore because it's sold. Oh, John kicked don't you, you know Did John anything? kick you off the property? I don't I don't understand. No, uh, we sold the property. The John and I moved. And the people that bought it are the people that own it now. And they, I, uh, the March I don't, first, I don't think it's advisable. Out of there. I don't think it's advisable to you say those people because the people I've seen there are, are ethnic. I don't think you're allowed to say that. Are what? Ethnic. Ethnic? Yeah, but they're different colored people from you and I. Well, who cares? I don't, the well, guy you, that bought you, the place, but you kept, his name is Ryan. You kept saying and those, has, it, you kept saying those people. He, he was, they're, they're probably, Cleaning it up. They're, they're, it was bought as is. So they're taking all of the stuff away from the property. Okay. John took as much as he could. Yeah. And then then uh, that w it was as is. And we're not allowed so to was re So what? It was after repoed? The bank took it? No. We got it sold. We sold it. All right. All right, I understand, but listen, I paid over a million for this for this property. I know, good and now, for you. And now the blight of your property with all the chicken shit all over everywhere is... It's not is... my property! Well, whose chickens it's are not these? not our property anymore. You didn't take your chickens when you moved? What's the matter with we you? We didn't have chickens! Ah, uh, yes, animal neglect. You didn't take your chickens. You just set them free in the world? Oh, my God, shut up! We didn't have chickens! Listen... I need you to come clean. Neither here nor there. They left a mess, and that's your responsibility. There's no. I never had a chicken in my life over there. So I don't know what you're talking about. So they just appeared at, by the grace of God. Chickens all over the place. I don't know, Dwight. Now listen. Shut up and the, leave me alone. The, I'm calling the police on the your ass. The poop's not going to clean itself. I don't care. Get. Some of your workers, you got 50,000 workers I don't pay there. my men to clean Get up poop. To we it. build things like Shut men. Shut up and don't call the police.
call me again. Get some gloves and some baggies. Get a trash bag and come over here and you need to start start picking it up by hand. There she goes. She finally. <laughs> oh, my God. What was that? Oh, my God. She was fired up. I sound so guilty. <laughs> she, knows she, she knows she left those chickens. That's what she did. She Keep left them. Sound bite gold. <laughs> sound bite gold. No, Dwight. Yeah, I love she kept accentuating the duh. <laughs> duh, white. Uh, she, hysterical. Okay. I don't know. Do we call her back or is it, we leave her alone after that? She, uh, she, she, she might pop a blood vessel. I'm not sure. <laughs> she probably won't answer. But I don't, yeah, I don't think be, she can resist answering a ringing phone. She might. <laughs> this is like the movie phone booth. Like you can't walk away from a ringing phone over here. Yeah. She's we're under the three limit. So it's up in the air. All right. Here, here we go. <laughs> Hello. I caught one of the chickens and it told me that you were the owner. Oh God, this is a prank. Isn't it's it? not a prank. Listen, he didn't actually talk to me, but I caught one of the little bastards. They're not bastards. They're animals. They're from God. So shut up. You're mean. Why are this you yelling? Are you? Do you need this to go to church? This is a prank. Shut up. You, it's a prank. Do you need to ride Quit to church? Upsetting me. I'm not call trying to upset else. you. I'm trying to call you about the chickens, and you're flipping out. I don't have. Yes, you, you idiot! You have a severe emotional I problem, ma'am. You have a severe emotional problem. Yeah, I do, because you're an idiot. You got me over here chasing chickens like I'm Rocky training to fight Apollo Creed. Oh, you're full of crap. What do you I mean? I don't even believe you. This is a prank. It's, it's not a prank. prank. No wonder call. no wonder John left you. You're irrational. <laughs> he probably caught you cheating. That's the best thing that ever happened hoarding to that chicken. guy, okay? You were hoarding Just chickens, probably. Up. You jerk face. Hey, hey. Shut up, Rob. You stink the butt. On your ass. Listen, stink butt. Shut up, Rob. Calling the police on your fucking ass. Jerky jerk. toes. Okay. Hello. Ma'am, I've gathered some of the neighbors Hello? and we're having a meeting about you. Yeah. I don't um, care. I don't live there anymore. See, guys, I told I don't you. I live Emma. there. No. Hold on. I'm, I'm the representative from Chick-fil-A, and I think you've given us some oh, substandard this is a, I chicken. knew it was a prank. I knew it was a prank. Oh, you guys are hilarious. Our customers are very unhappy with the chickens, you, with your chickens. This is the They're very for unhappy. Colonel Sanders. They do not meet the standards that our guests have come to expect. Your chickens are like grade D. They're horrible. Don't God, sell it to us ever again. Guys, we got to get the chickens out of the road. Here comes a car. Watch out. Oh, no. Why did the chicken cross the road? They get hit by this fucking car. the feathers everywhere quick quick get, get, oh, get, get that one could probably be saved give that one mouth to mouth oh okay here wow. <laughs> you saved it you saved it it's back it's back you're the best you're the best the colonel's so proud oh my god what in the world don't you, i've got you know i've got so much work to do i don't have time for this crap so quit calling me. I'm watching the Suns, okay? It's a close game. Take, the Suns? Take your chickens home, then, lady. Hey, Ew. the Sharks won. That's something that doesn't happen every day or every month. or A shark? Every, They're playing those months. Celtics, you idiot. The, the Celtics? <laughs> oh, those guys, are, those guys are those those guys guys are are racist. Two different sports. <laughs> Maybe if, if what is this, a radio station? Yeah. This is my favorite no. radio station. You, you wanna hear, yeah, you want to hear the jingle? Hang on. Yeah, yeah me. Yeah, just, just, can we give you a shirt? The mouth. The mouth. For that. <laughs> if we gave you a t-shirt, would it make it all better, man? Do you board chickens? Yeah. Like, I have several chickens that need to be boarded because I'm going to take a trip. Um, I don't. 
I don't sign. never have owned a chicken in my life. So go, you know, oh, suck that. Can, can, can we call cop use me? Can, can what did we, you say? <laughs> can we ask... Um, did you watch this? Did you gamble away John's freedom papers on the outcome of one of the Suns games, and then you lost and you had to you had to turn him in? What happened there? John John Forner. Yeah, your your he ex. He doesn't your, watch your, your ex husband. Your ex husband. John does porn. Is that yeah? What no, he doesn't watch. He doesn't watch uh, basketball. He doesn't watch any sports. All is he, he does is, he, is work. Yeah, is he living over on Juanita Ave now? No. Oh, okay. I thought he was back in Mesa. He lives in Tombstone. Oh, okay. No, he lives in Tombstone. You should um Yeah. You should oh. get you should give us his his number. Never mind, I got his number. It's okay. <laughs> what does his phone number end in? I just want to confirm. Leave. What what's the last four? I wouldn't tell you that. He doesn't have time. We work for a living. Okay, I bet it's, I I bet it's 6671. Probably alcoholic you don't, drug addicts. Alcoholic If you addicts. don't give us the number, if, if you, you don't are. give us the number, I'll have to revoke your chicken handler license. <laughs> <laughs> I don't even remember the last time I ate chicken. Oh, what are you, you too good for chicken? Sanders. You like the fillet mignon or something? Yeah, she won't put she won't put cock in her mouth. Oh, God! And that's why she's divorced. <laughs> where, where where are you guys from? It happens. It happens. You guys, you can't be the guy across the street. That's for sure. I from, am the guy from the south like, side of top of the line. Of Any cock will do. He's top of the line, the guy across the street. So you're you're an idiot. Don't but worry, I'm gonna idiot. I'm gonna send my bobcat to go get these chickens. <laughs> ma'am, ma'am, I, I don't care. They're not my chickens. To... And the chicken wants to talk to you. He seems pretty upset with the way he's been treated by you. Uh, we took him through regressive I like, therapy. I don't like chickens. <laughs> Well, I'm a I'm a chicken psychologist, and I I hypnotize the chicken. Okay. Well, you know what? I don't I don't have time. I don't have time for this. I work for a living, unlike you. You You're know, a working we lady. used to do that when I was like 15, 14 years old. We used to play pranks like this. Hello. Grow up. You must not have been Grow very good at it, or you'd still be doing it. Hello. But the chicken has trauma associated Grow with up. your handling of it. And the chicken wants you to apologize. Here, I've got the I've got the chicken on the line. I'm touching Please myself. apologize to the chicken. I'm not even listening to you now. I'm trying to disconnect. So you don't know how to hang up the phone? Like <laughs> don't you don't work. You don't she ain't work. gonna bother nobody now. Oh, we did chickens. We and take a boat on chickens. We're all alcoholic potheads. That's what you are. All alcoholic. <laughs> yeah, that's what she said. We're all drug addicts. <laughs> uh, Favorite I chicken? Mean, Popeyes, Chick Fil A. What are we talking? What do we like here? She's watching half me hit that's a bomb. <laughs> half that's true. Oh, am I supposed to call her again? No, no. No, that was three. That was three. Yeah, she's we not. She's three. not playing anymore. She's just kind of. Yeah. She's um, in on it. Okay. Yeah, she yeah. got a laugh out of it. So it was a successful call. Yeah. Yeah. I'm good. myself now. You, you keep on doing your thing, Hello. Dwight. Uh, I'm a dial. Let me help you. Hi, how you doing there? Good, good. Good, I'm good. A, how are you? I'm pretty good. Uh, I'm uh, calling. I'm looking to, uh, to prepay a bond. Okay. Yeah, so tell me about your situation. Well, it uh, it hasn't it hasn't occurred yet. It's just uh, I've got some plans for this weekend, and uh, I want to make sure that I can get out like as soon as I go in. Got it. And um, did you receive a call from like a detective or officer, or you just kind of suspect that they could arrest you? No, no, I I haven't committed a crime or nothing yet. I'm just saying I I want to have that just set so uh, you know when they when I get caught, I want to be able to just be arrested and then just uh, come right on out. Right. Okay. Got it. Because yeah, my so, uh, my uh, ex my ex girl uh, she uh, she she recently uh, got a rest well it's not a restraining order yeah we're going to court on it still but she locked me out and uh, I've got some of my uh, you know those top shelf trading cards yeah, I got some of the Lebrons and stuff and I'm trying to sell and uh, she won't let me have them back she says until we see the restraining order and the judge we're not going to do anything about it 
So uh, I got this. Uh, you ever watch some of the Mac- Acme cartoon things? Well, they actually have some yeah. of these tools. They got like a suction cup thing, and they got one of those glass cutters. And so I'm going to go and just cut a nice uh, like glass and little it- hole there, and I'm going to go in and get my top shelf trading cards. Oh, okay. Got you. And okay. So, and so I'm afraid, you know, she's going to call the hey, cops no. on me. Right, right. And what 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 city uh, what city would uh, what is the residence at? Uh, well, it's uh, oh, it's over here. Uh, it's in L.A., but um, it, like kind of it's kind of on the border. It can actually be just a couple of a uh, a couple of uh, different ones here. But yeah, it's 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 close to like Burbank and stuff. Like like it's right there on the border. Like you got Pasadena that's over to the east. It's like it's really south of Burbank. Yeah. And it like almost borders on Los Angeles. Right. And so I'm not sure right. where they where they would end up taking me, but like I'm looking to get like, uh, do you got like a book of ten prepaid bonds I can do? So we don't do prepaid bonds. Like the only thing is like memorize this number. Yeah. And then call us and we'll get you out. You well, I want to I want to buy them we almost like a book yeah. of stamps, you know. You know, you buy them, you, you use them when you need them. Right. Right. Yeah, it, it doesn't work it doesn't work that way. It, it we will need to know the bail amount first. Yeah. All right. Um, um what's you, yeah. you know, you probably know. What is the um what's the line there where it crosses from uh from a misdemeanor to a felony? Um well, as long as you don't use violence it's no, no, she, 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 she's she's yeah. not even going to be home. I think I'm going to get my top shelf trading cards. Uh, and I thought about urinating on the bed uh, so she doesn't have another guy in there, you know, kind of like marking my territory. But not, you know, nothing crazy. I'm not going to, you know, do holes in walls, nothing physical or anything like that. Right, right. Yeah, I would say, you know, as long as you just do that, um, it only becomes a felony when you use physical force. From what, I, from what I've seen. Oh, yeah, yeah. I'm not going to use a weapon or nothing. No physical force. Just just a good uh, just just a good urination, you know. Like like I said, I don't want to... That bed, we bought that bed together. And I don't want her, you know, right. you know using her, her blowhole with another man on a bed that I purchased. I feel that's, a, that's an insult to me anyway. And like right, I said, right. she could avoid this all. She just gave me my goddamn trading cards. Um, you know, and right. then she no, she got you. some of my Pokemon my Pokemon trading cards too, and I just you know I'm I'm kind of pissed about oh, that. Right, right. Well, yeah, you know, save a uh, memorize this number, and then they give you free calls if you were to get arrested, and just give us a call, and we'll help you then. Okay, because like I think I can get a lot of money. I, I'm going to trade in some of these cards. That's that's what I'm going to end up probably using for for bail. You collect some of these cards. Um, I don't really collect. Yeah, we don't collect really cards. I got some real, real like, rare ones in here. Yeah. No, no, I understand, but it's just for my personal myself, yeah, I would collect them, but I can't accept it. Like, and be hot. It's just as good as currency. Yeah. I'm, I'm telling you, you probably get a lot more coin than I would get. You know, giving you some of these uh, dollars over here. No, no, no. I understand. No, I, I do. I, I do know they're high value um, um, assets. So, so yeah. Yeah. Um, yeah. You know. Yeah. Like. Yeah, so, yeah, give us a call. Hopefully not, but, you know, if something happens, give us a call. All right. Hey, do you know, you know one time I called, uh, when I was in Hawaii, I called Dog the Bounty Hunter to tell him he'll never catch me? Oh, really? That's yeah, and, and, and then he caught me. I was out on Bond oh, with did him. He? Yeah, yeah, I was on his TV show. Uh, yeah, he caught me. Oh, okay. Uh, I, I, oh, okay. I, res- I resisted a, a, a little bit, like, but his uh, his son, his fun, uh, son, Dwayne Lee, yeah, he came in there, he jumped on me. Like and, and then like the old man, old dog there. He tried to act all all hard and shit. He was down there yelling at me, like in my face. And then like they took me back. You know they did the whole thing where they tried to tell me like, oh you got you got to look to God, brother. You got to you know a second chance. And and then I I I I, I serviced him sexually and he let me right. go. He let me go. Right. Okay, man. Well, yeah. Hopefully not. You don't get in trouble. But yeah, give us a call if you are in custody. Okay. Oh, wait a minute. Have a good wait, night. wait, wait, wait. One more, one more thing. Hang on, just a second here. Uh, let's see here. Stay, stay on the phone with me. I need an alibi. All right. They, all right. Let's see. I think they're over here. I can't fucking see. Get the flashlight. Turn the flashlight on this phone. So you watch any of the sports, the sports balls or anything? Where are they? No, not right now, man. But yeah, like I, I said, got it. Give us a call. 
I got, I okay. Got, hang on, I got. All right, best of luck to you, man. I, I think I got him. Hang All on. Right. Oh shit! I like the alibi aspect. That was cool. Stay on the line. I'm telling you guys, like, when Stay I talked to, I need an alibi. <laughs> I talked to Dog years ago, man. It's always been a great premise, man. It's always uh, yeah. It's he he told me I was just doing a misdemeanor, so like he, I don't think he was gonna bail me out. He he was like, ah, you're gonna do shit. You'll uh, be right. <laughs> urinize in the bed. <laughs> oh, hang on, I might be able to find it real quick. Uh, J2H has called Rick Flair. Rick Flair has never answered his phone when we called him. Um, let's see if I can find Dog the Bounty the Dog the Bounty Hunter call. Uh, no bonds. Yeah, I need hey. to get a bond. Okay, where's it at? Uh, I'm at the correctional facility over here. Which island? Uh, on uh, Oahu. Okay, how much is your bond? Uh, it's a five hundred dollar bond. Oh, I don't do bonds. That's fine. That's not a bond. No, no. Well, it's a five thousand, but I think they say I gotta they gotta pay five hundred. And what is it charge for five thousand? Uh, it was domestic violence. Okay, so it's you. It's on yourself. Yeah. So you would have to have a co-signer call me because you have to have a co-signer. Mm-hmm. And it, you're correct. It would cost you five hundred. Okay. So, yeah. you want someone to call me on your behalf? Yeah, I'll have someone call. Yeah, because uh, they arrested me because I was, okay, I was me... beating my own dick every night. Ooh. What? Yeah. <laughs> Is that funny or hey, what? Dog. Is Benny hey, dog. Hey, dog. You, you gonna give what? us any any jobs yet? You told us to get back in contact. Oh, yeah, I do have one. Uh, let me see. Oh, oh. Let me put it together. Call me in 10 minutes. Okay. All right. Love you. There there was a, <laughs> there was a previous call where he was like, you guys are good. You obviously have a burner number. He's like, I want to put you to work. He's like, I'll have you track down some of my jumps and all this shit. Is, is that Dwayne himself? Oh yeah, that was that was Dog the Bounty Hunter right oh, there. That was Dog for sure. Yeah, dude, Dwayne dog. fucking Chapman. Holy shit. Yeah, yeah, he. Uh, I don't know if I have the first one. I'd have to look, but let's do a call while we look. Thank you for calling your bail bond office. Press any key for immediate bail service. Thank you for contacting your bail bond specialist. How can I help you? Hi. Um, I'm getting ready to be uh, arrested. The, the police the police are outside right now. I need to know what my bail's okay. my bail's going to be uh, before I go out there and talk to um, these these motherfuckers as it is. Mm-hmm. And okay. so I want um, to I want to know about what I'm what I'm facing. Okay, so we won't know your charges until uh, you get updated, but. Um... Well, I the, 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 me? well the charge I went I went down to uh, a local restaurant that was closed and I stole I stole six six hundred pounds of grade sushi meat and they they fo- I dropped it there was a hole in the bag and they followed me back to my place so I don't know okay. what what that is I, I don't know if that is like what's the like because I know down here I see a lot of things about like thousand dollar like they can't make it a felony or something over it so I'm guessing misdemeanor. But I just moved here, so I don't I don't know how that is, because I I had a real hankering for shrimp tempura, and I guess I could have went to some place that was open, but in, I like I was watching TikTok and I was like this doesn't look too hard I can make my own, but the thing is I didn't I didn't have any fish I didn't have any grade sushi meat. Okay, and you stole it. Yeah, yo, I definitely stole it. Yeah. Okay, so then um, a robbery. Um, no, there, there was no, there was no gun, there was no, there was no, there was no guns. Uh, it was closed, and I kicked, I kicked the, I kicked the door. I gave the 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 handle a jiggle, and then a push, and then it opened. And uh, I mean, realistically, they should have had something more strong to keep that door closed. 
that's going to be my defense, but that's, I mean, you don't need to know that. That's all I'm saying is like, if they wanted to secure something, they should have more than just, you know, a deadbolt lock. And then, you know, the, the, the dogs in there and stuff like that. Mm -hmm. um, um, let me see. Okay. So I'm, I don't know what else they're going to charge you with, but, um, for a robbery or theft, I guess. Yeah, um, theft. theft. I like. I see. I like to be called a thief better than a robber. I like the vernacular that you have. Okay. Oh. Um, so oh boy. Theft. And what's your name? Oh, my name's Dwight. And I'm a criminal. I, I'll admit that. Mhm. Mm okay. And what's your last name? Uh, the last name uh, is uh, Johnson. It's J O H N S O N N. There's two N's on the end. Okay. Um. So we're gonna. I'd have to wait until you get um book so that we can see your charges. Hang, hang, that hang, is hang, usually. Hang on. Hang on. I'm I gotta look um, through the. I gotta look through the curtains. Oh shit! Here they come. Hello. Hi. How are you? I'm Hello. Call I'm calling about the the chair. Yes. Um, is it still? Yes, we have a chair uh -huh. that we're giving away. Is it still available? Yes, it is. All right. Um, is this a chair that that? Um, I'm sorry. Is it? Is this Evelyn? Yes, it is. Hi, Evelyn. How are you? Hi. Hang on, just a second. I've got the TV going. I got to put it on mute. Ooh. I can't even. Oh, I'm hard of hearing. I'm sorry. Okay. Okay. Go ahead. Um, so I, I was calling about the chair because I, uh, you're on the neighbor app, right? I'm sorry. Say that again. You're on the neighbors app, right? You listed it on there as well. Uh, I don't know where he posts. My husband's the one that posted it. Oh, oh, is it uh, Richard? Richard, your husband? Yeah. Yeah, he put it on the neighbors app as well. Oh. Oh. Okay. And um, I just I, I was calling about the chair, but I also um, I I, just, I accidentally um, my my ch I I dropped my my child on your roof. Huh? I was flying him over to the babysitter by drone, and my batteries became weak, and the drone landed and dropped the baby on your roof. Oh, I don't understand. How? Oh. It dropped the what on my roof? My baby, my toddler. I was flying him by drone to the babysitter, and I I didn't charge no. it up fully last night, so it, it made a safe landing on your roof, but he's up there. I I'm looking at aerial footage right now. Uh, you have the the uh, oh you got the rocks in the front yard. Uh, let's see here. You got you have a baby on top of my roof. Yeah, yeah. I was trying to deliver him like a stork over to the babysitter because I gotta go to work. No, this is a joke. No, no joke, man. This is a joke. Uh, uh. Nope. I'm looking at. I'm looking at. We released the baby so I could get some weight off of the drone and you know so the battery's better. No. Yep. Wait. Right there. Yeah. <laughs> are you, you across? Know, are you across from the guy on, that has a bit? Is... Do you? Are you across the street from the guy that has the big uh? Uh, the big trees, like the what is those the the palm trees, the thick palm trees. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. I'm looking at them right now. I don't. How do you do? Um, you know, my husband is unavailable it's right a, it's now. It's okay, baby. I can't go out. It's I okay. I'm talking. I'm, ta well. I'm talking to him through the speaker. It's okay. It's okay. This nice old woman. This nice old woman gonna be fine. It's okay. He's he's good. He's fine. He's fine. The the the, the, the buzzing the buzzing kind of the buzzing no the buzzing from the from the drone is soothing him. Self self soothing. I I can't I I don't I don't understand what's going on here. It's okay. Do you have a ladder and he can he can scoot down. He's a very smart baby. You know what? This has got to be some kind of 
joke. No, because, no. <laughs> you know, nobody puts a baby in a... Jesus, I can't... I can't believe this, and I can't get to my fucking husband. What in the hell is going on? No, we put him in a harness. You know, it's like, you know, you've seen the movie Operation Dumbo Drop with a with an elephant. It's like you that, know. but with a baby. Oh God, I'm going to call the police. No, why would God, you? Why gonna... why would you do that? It's not an emergency. He's fine. He's still in the uh the like the little diaper sling. He ain't going nowhere. He's got a drone attached my, to him that weighs more than he does. He ain't, he's not going anywhere. Why am I listening to this shit? Fuck I'm out know. here in my in my pajamas. And I, fuck, I don't. No, this can't be. This, he needs to be breastfed. This has got to be a gag. No. I don't know what you're doing. When when you're you get just, when you get him, can you breastfeed him? I can't get to him. Well, I, hey, hang on. Let me see if I got any more juice in this thing. Let's see if I can fly him down to your front porch. No, you know what? You need to call the police and get over, get somebody over here, if that's the truth. Do you drive him over? Or if you don't, I'm going to call the police. No, don't call the cops. Why would you do that? He's not because in danger. He's not this in danger. This is crazy. This is shit. He's fine. He's fine. He's yeah. fine. Little baby, you okay? He came to stop the car on, on our roof. What happened to him? Hello? Hi. I, do I have to explain the whole story? Did she tell you what happened with the drone and my baby? Drone and your baby. Yeah, I was flying him over to the babysitter, but I didn't charge it all the way. So, like, it it was it made a safe landing before, you know, it crashes. They do that. And I landed on top of your, your trailer as it is. Is that right? Yeah. I just wanted to know if you can go, up there, go up there and I grab him. What? Can you go up there and I grab him? It's okay. You want me, it's you want it's me okay, to baby. And grab. Sorry, I'm talking to him through the drone speaker. It's okay. It's okay. I got a nice old man on the phone. It's okay. Yeah. You're so full of shit. It's unbelievable. Good whoa, night. Whoa, good whoa, night. whoa, 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 whoa. Hello, you've reached Gene Clean with Rust USA Realty. I'm not available right now to take your call. Please leave your name and number, and I'll be back with you shortly. Thank you so much, and make it a great day. Hey, Gene, um, I, I have an issue. Um, I thought I wrote you several letters about your, your big palm tree being a nuisance uh, because of all the pollen and stuff it releases. Um, I, just wanted, I would just want to let you know that I, I tossed several like brown snakes. They're not poisonous or anything, just brown snakes up into your tree. So you, you might want to get rid of it now because it's got snakes. And they go... Some tree snakes now. How do they go again? <laughs> That's how they go. Oops, play. Hello. Hi, I'm calling about the uh, the fecal the the bagged fecal stuff you have. <laughs> yes. Oh, let me turn my radio off here. Hang on. Thank you. Um, so, it's it's is it um has it been filtered or anything or is it all just is it like raw or no, what's going I on have horses. There? They poop and I bag it. I don't compost. Oh, okay. So, so there hasn't been any eggs or anything like that, or like eggshells or um, anything, anything like nope, that. Nope, it's just horse poop. Okay. Uh, and then how much of it do you have, like on hand? If you, I don't know, do you divide I the bag have or pounds? Forty bags. Okay. How much each bag weighs? Probably have um, 25, 30 pounds. It varies. Okay. No, that's fine. Just an estimate is great. Um, and it's it's free from what I understand because I was given this information secondhand. Yes. Mm -hmm. Okay. Um, is it any of it spoken for? Or is it all available if like one person wanted it all? It's first come, first serve. <laughs> okay. All right. So right now there's 40 bags ready to go. Okay. Because I have these these um, these guys. They, they like they chase me around a lot, and I'm trying to set. Uh, I guess what you would call almost like a home alone ish style type trap for them. And so I, I, I need to get, I, I think 20 bags would be plenty. Um, I might want to go with more. I don't know. Um, but I'm going to put it all in sure. the back of a, a truck, the, you know, the wood sides and stuff and no, no tailgate. And I'm going to get on a skateboard yeah. and I'm going to skate around Hill Valley. And then as they chase me, I'm going to get out of the way real quick and they're going to smash it to the back of a truck 
and then manure is going to go all into the car you know it's a convertible and he's like, oh, i hate manure like i got it all planned out but biff deserves it okay biff's been chasing me around since i was in high school and i'm 40 years old now and he keeps coming in after me mm, sure that's an interesting use for it but uh, sure well, no, he was my high school bully, and he just never grew up. But I never moved out of the town, and he stays here, I think, just to torment me. Okay, well, call me back when you want to get the plan done. When I get the what done? When can I come get it? Please. Uh, Do you ever find that number, uh, uh, Crispy? Are you still eating the sushi? Crispy's leaning right into the... Uh, you know, the, the stereotype about Asians, you know, she's like, Oh, I could, um, I could, I could have a hot dog. She says, but what's she do? No, she gets sushi. I have to go through my contacts, but it's kind of old. So I don't know. Wait a minute. How, why did you have her number first. in your contacts? Um, we went to business seminars, the same business seminar. So it was like a networking event. So oh. I don't even know. I should, I should be giving it out. Did but. she, did she hit on you? <laughs> No. No, she wasn't I into that that, so. I, that phase I yet. I, I didn't really feel like I I don't know. She, I think she, she has kids, right? She does. She she also had two husbands. Uh, but uh, I think it was during the last year she uh, she married a woman. Yep. I I think she was still great when I first met her years ago. Oh. Oh, I mean, she could have been. Hello. Good evening, Tim Carlin, Line Belmont. Jacob, I'm help you. Hi, how you doing? I'm good, sir. How are you? I'm pretty good. Uh, listen, uh, I'm down here at uh, Muscle Beach right now, and uh, I'm standing over there. Some cops right here, and I'm pretty sure I'm gonna get arrested. Uh, okay, do you know what for? Uh, they're talking. They're, they're getting uh, this one guy. He fucking tried to punk me out here, right? And uh, so I, I, I literally told him, I said, go ahead and lift this. And I gave him like some real heavy fucking dumbbells there. And he lifted and I pulled it. I pulled his pants down. Now they're talking about some assault because I exposed his pecker. Okay. Um, well, right now I really can't do anything because we, you know, we don't know your bail amount or if you're actually going to get arrested or anything like that. Yeah, yeah. Um, I'm just looking to uh, maybe give you guys a credit card right now, put it on file to prepay a bond or something here. Uh, unfortunately, we can't do that, boss man. Um, it's against the uh, it's against the law for us. Unfortunately, we have to wait until you're officially booked in. I mean, I, I don't know why like they're, they're they're uh, they're like gonna even charge me with that and everything. He was the one with his pecker out in a public place. I mean, they're not even talking about charging him. Yeah, I understand. Like I said, I don't believe you may you may not get arrested. Like I said, if um, if you do, just remember this phone number. Because unfortunately they're going to take your phone. You're not going to be able to use your phone to try to get some right. numbers down. I, I mean, it, it, you probably know a little bit about the law in your in your type of uh, your field, there. I mean, is that really assault? I mean, I didn't hit him. Um, I didn't hit him or nothing. Honestly, sir, it kind of just depends on uh, on the arresting officer. Yeah, um, I just I honest, just tugged on the fabric. Want... I mean, I think he should have had a belt on. Yeah, yeah. I mean, if he wants to be a dick and stuff like that, then he can go and uh, book and book you in uh -huh. under that charge or. Yeah, I really, I really can't say. Okay, yeah, like he, uh, I mean, they, they talked about, they talked about it. I'm just, I'm just like, I, I, I disagree, and I like, I don't, I don't know what I could do. Like, I, I, like, he's still looking. Like, I, 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 I could run, but I don't. I, I mean, I, I don't, yeah, I mean, I if they didn't officially arrest you or tell you to stay, to stay there, I mean, I, I would probably go in and. Uh, Try to just walk away and see what they say. I'm gonna run away on three. Hang on, hang on, hang on, hang on. He's looking, he's looking. Hang on. All right, I'm out. I'm out. A few moments later. Yeah, you're doing there. I'm trying to uh, get a hold of somebody about some uh, some rental. Okay, yeah. It's uh, down on Court Street. Yeah, yeah, Court Street, correct. 
Yeah, there's two two units there. There's for rent. There's a um, there's a one bedroom that's eleven fifty, and there's a three bedroom one uh, one and a half baths is fourteen fifty. All right. So there's there is other people staying in in there too, right? Uh, on Monday, there will be somebody there on Monday. Okay. Uh, what are the chances I could just rent the uh, rent all the whole house? What would that run me like without anybody else being there? You can just do what? Like you know, I like instead of just renting a unit, uh, guy just rent the whole thing. That's what I'm trying to ask. Oh, well, somebody has to be there. Well, yeah, I'll be I'll be there. You talking about another person being there or, or me being there? Yeah, no, I don't. I'm, t I'm sorry, I don't understand what you mean. I want to rent the like all the uh, the, the available units. I want to rent them all. What do you mean, another person in the in the rental? I thought I you said understand. somebody was going to be there Monday, like uh, like another person. Yeah, there's a man working there. He's oh, working oh, there five oh, okay, days okay. Away. okay. I thought you were saying Monday. there was another person staying there on Monday, like like a person that was uh, renting or something. Okay. No, no. I uh, th what I'm trying to do is uh, I, I just wanna I just wanna kind of uh, like all the space in there. Like I want it all. I'm, I'm asking how much? How much does that run to, to to get it all? What do you mean you want it all? How many How many units do you have in there? Two. There's three. There's one in the back. There's a cottage, and the front house is at like a duplex. All right. I, I want to get all three. You. I run it. I run wanna, it. You want to get all three? Yes. Yeah, yeah. See, I run a I, online. I do a streaming service, and uh, I run kind of a game show, right? So, like, I want to convert all of them. And uh, I'm just gonna stream the internet from there, and we're you know we're gonna get wacky. We're gonna get the wet mops out. We're gonna we're gonna slap each other. We're gonna punch holes in the walls. It's gonna be great. It brings in a lot of big well, cash well, enough to repair it all. Living in the unit in the back. All right, we'll get them out. They can, yeah, yeah, they can't be moved. Uh, well, I mean, they could. You 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 probably can't do it because you're the landlord. But I I could have them moved. You you know what I'm saying? Like I'm out I'm out front yeah, right now. Yeah, hang on. Yeah, I don't know. We, hey, hang on. I'm out, I'm out, look I'm out front right now. I'm gonna I'm gonna move an application. Well, we'll I'm gonna I'm out front. It. I'm gonna move them now. Here we go. I'm gonna get this door out of the way. And then here here we go. Well, there's, well, there's nobody there now. Ah, that's why it's dark in here. Son of a bitch. Well, now there's glass on the floor. What do you mean you're gonna move the? You're going to do what now? They got to go. I can't stay here if they're there. It's ridiculous. I don't share. Look, listen, uh, I don't like what you're saying. If you want, I'll call the police and send them over there. Why would you call the police? I thought we were friends. You're my landlord. Yeah, you were talking about breaking glass there? Well, why, why are you using vulgar language? I'm sorry. Don't, don't, don't call the police on me for cussing, please. My mom will be cursed yeah, with me. Don't, cursed yeah, with me. Well, don't, don't stay away from the building, please. I, I do not want to rent to you. But you're my landlord. We have a verbal contract. Hey, goodbye. Hey, asshole. Hey. Hi, you've reached Osher's machine. We'd like to remind you that God loves you and that he, he just wants you to love him back. We would like you to leave a message. Thanks. Mary, Satan wants his fruit. Give me the citrus. I want all the citrus that you have to offer. Mary, you and Gary need to bring me the citrus. Give it to me now. Mm. I will send my demons to get in the trees. They now populate the trees. The trees are ours. The trees are one. <coughs> Doing that voice fucked my throat up. I need water. Mark speaking. Hi, Mark. How are you? Good. Good. Uh, do, do you want to talk about the issue or no? Uh, 
Uh, what issue? About the house. <clears throat> you, you got all those trees and stuff out in front. Why? What? Yeah, the, the trees in front. What's going on with them? They're not being kept up. What property are you talking about? Uh, the the one on Twenty uh, Fourth Ave. The gray house. Ten thousand. Yeah. Yeah. No, the, yeah. Oh eight. Yeah. So, on Twenty Fourth Street. Yeah, the ones by the ditch. Right. What's wrong with it? What well, there? You keep putting some type of fertilizer on them or something? Like, are you putting those sticks in, like the the grow the grow sticks or whatever they are? You put them near the plants? Nope. Okay, it's but some, something's running off from those trees and into the ditch water, and it's making my son very very sick. Who is this? Who is this? Who the my, hell is this? My name's Dwight. Yeah, Dwight. Where are you from? Where you from, dude? I'm from down the road. Where at down the road? What's your address? What What do you mean? What's my address? I know you guys live. You guys live right across the street from that brown thing, right? I want to make sure I'm not getting the wrong person. I don't want to be. I don't want to be that person. Well, you are being that person. That's I'm down here. At I'm down here, at, ma'am. I'm down here at ninety nine ten, and my son drinks out of that ditch. Your son. Your son drinks out of the ditch. Yes, he gets that water. They've been teaching him in science class that that's clean rainwater, and they collect it and he drinks it because it has a nutrients. Because we used to give him purified water bottles, but then you know it just makes him sick. You know it, he yeah. needs the nutrients. Okay. So I need okay, you to so stop. Here's the deal. Okay, I'm sorry. Here's here's the deal. You need to listen. Okay, here's the situation. Sure. First of all, a Pierce County runs the ditches. Okay. So if you have a problem with your son drinking out of the ditch, you need to call that, Pierce County. No, no, that's not my problem. My problem County, is you're polluting Pierce, it right there. Like he comes and gets in that ditch Pierce right County. next to your driveway, and he get he gets it. Hello? I'm sorry. What happened? I I don't know. I thought that was I thought that was on your end. No, no, partner. No, no. So, okay. So What's happening with the ditch? So he goes so he goes at night uh, and he collects water from several different points down he collects it from the ditch. And only okay. and he labels them so he knows where he gets them from. So he has gotcha, cup gotcha. 1, 2, 3, you know, and so on. So when he right. gets to cup three, which is where he gets it next to your driveway, next to those trees, okay, he gets sick because he only drinks them one one a day. You know, he has them one through seven, and on day three, gotcha. on Wednesday, well, I, he gets I, I sick from the water. To... So, can you hear me, sir? Yes, I can hear you. Oh, I'm sorry. I, I'm changing over my earpiece, so... I'm really concerned because we are 100% organic here on this property. Okay. I don't put out fertilizer or any of that stuff, but you have to understand that there is cross ditches that come across. Okay. Mm -hmm. So there, if you look at my main driveway, there's a ditch that comes across from the church side. The church. Yep. Okay. So, uh, 100 we, we don't fertilize anything i mean i haven't even put out uh my, if you look at my yard it's a 90 percent moss i even put moss killer out there oh okay. so i'm really concerned too um so there there's something going well, yeah, cause on because there, there is because there is down the way they do have uh I know there's some people down over this way. They have like a, a little miniature barn and stuff over here, and they got they got some uh, a, a couple of animals and stuff. Uh, maybe maybe it's runoff from them. 
Uh, they live across from, yeah, from no, the church. No, no I'm, I'm really concerned because I don't want that because we put nothing on there. Okay. Um, I, I, and I'm going to apologize now because I did come and dig up no, one no, of your... No, 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 oh, I, I want to know more. Well, no, I did dig up one of your trees and brought, brought it back so I could test it. You did? Yeah. What what trees was that? The the pine, the, the ones right in front of the ditch. I the, you know the row of them. In front of which ditch? In front of you, in front of your house. I don't understand the question. You have a row of trees right in front of the ditch, right next to your drive. So, you know, the, so, uh, yeah, right, right. So we have the. What are those trees called, honey? I don't. They they were pines or arborvitae. Uh, yeah. No, so I don't know, I don't know what trees are named. They're by the pole though, by the telephone pole. The power pole. Yeah, so we have arborvitus, and we had, oh, man, it was just a big job going on. I, we went to put those in and just put a nice front fascia there, and we had to dig down, and there was nothing but roots in there from an old system, so mm -hmm. big old spruce tree and stuff. Right. But he took, so, he, took he took the one to the far right. The far, so facing the property or facing out? Like if you're facing the property from the road all the way to the right. Facing the property to the road, all the way to the right. That would be over by yeah. other neighbors. Yeah, that going towards the property line of your other neighbors, the ones that have the, uh, oh, the white, the white fence, the, like the the half fence by the drive there, the white one. White fence by the drive. I don't. They got the they got the two because oh. they got the gravel and then they got the asphalt oh, the, driveway. Oh, okay. Yeah. Oh yeah, yeah. No, that's to our right. So if you face my house, that's to the right. That's so. Yeah, yeah. So Jim, okay, I got you. Yeah, it's right. It's so right next to the. Uh, yeah, it's right next to there. Yep. Yeah. No. If you want to take any sample, I I got no problem with that because yeah, he, good, he took he took the he whole tree. He took the whole tree though. The whole tree. Yeah. Um, I'm not sure what tree he took, but anyway. Okay, so I, where I are just, you at? I, I just I'm, I'm at home right now, but I, I just don't understand why you tried to kill no, no, why no. you tried to kill my son. I didn't try to kill your son. I would think nothing. I, I don't want to kill nobody. I mean, I don't know what he did to you that, that you've been trying to poison him like this. Why would you be, Why would you say that? You're making accusations. I don't even know your son. Yeah, and that's that's the other disturbing part is you don't know him like personally. I don't. Did you? Did he? Like, well, I'd like to meet him. And I'd like to meet you because uh, I'm a pretty friendly guy. Did he walk out in front of your car or something? Did, did he curse at you? What happened? Nobody's harmed me at all in this neighborhood. I love this neighborhood. I love all my neighbors. Okay, yeah, and that's what everyone else has told me because I've asked people about you. I'm like, I'm like, hey, what, what do you know about Mark? And like, a lot of them are just like, oh, you know, the only thing I, the only thing I know is he's like, he's like 56 years old. Yeah, no, I'm good. I, I'm good. I'd love to meet you and your son and take him and go along with him. Hey, hey, do you, do you hear that again? I, I'm not imagining that, right? Are you hearing that too? I'm hearing that crazy stuff too. Yeah, I don't know what that is, is, but I can definitely hear it. Oh man, that's crazy. I was making sure you could hear it though. No, I can. It, it sounds like I thought maybe that was your wife or something making weird sounds trying to just force me off the phone. No. Because it sounds like no, a woman making really car cool crashing sounds or something like that. I don't know. Um, no, no, she's really cool too. I, I, so you, you, where do you live now? I, I live down here at ninety nine ten. Ninety nine ten. Yeah, I'm well, on the opposite. 10, I, I think that... I'm on the opposite side of the street of you. Um, well, ninety nine ten is So's place. It's right next to, uh, yeah, right next to the church actually. That's so. My that's my buddy So's place. So he lives at ninety nine ten. So yeah, he's su he's subletting a room to me. No, no, he built yeah. the house. He's got his family there. I, he's renting a room to me. That's what I'm telling you. Me and my son stay in a single room because I just recently got divorced. At and So's so, place? Yeah, and he, so he's taking me in. So what's So's full name? What is his full name? I don't I don't know. He's just So. That's all I know him is So. That's how I answered his ad. No. No, there's there, there's his full name, bud. So well, you're messing I don't, with me. I don't understand. No, no, I don't. I don't understand. Okay, so I'd really like to meet you. Okay, we can we can make that happen. That's no problem. All right. How about right now? 
Uh, yeah, that's. I mean, that, yeah, that's fine with me. I gotta yeah, go. I gotta I go. I you. got. I gotta go. Ask uh, uh, Punlock if I can like go out tonight. Like if he's gonna lock it in front of me or not. Or who? I'm talking about Soj. Soj. Soj Heath. Soj Heath Kong. So where are you going to meet him? Well, you gotta no, go I got to ask him if he's going to lock the door behind me when I go. I, I want to make sure I can get back in because I don't have a key yet. We got to go to the hardware and get a key made. Hmm. Okay. Yeah, Soj Heath don't play so, he, he, like with his safety. Right, right. Because we're, we're neighbors. We're buds. We protect each other. Right. No, I, I, can, I can understand that. Like, uh, is Art still, Art's still here, though? Like, you hang out with Art, or? I don't know who Art is, but Art, well, Art stays here. That uh, doesn't sound right, my friend. Well, I mean, it doesn't make it but, any but, less so. I but mean, where, do you, where do you want to meet? Where, let's go out right now. I'll, I'll put my boots on and okay. let's go out there. Where, can, where can are you Ma at? Can Maria come with us? I don't know who she is, but. Or he is, uh, sure. Okay. All right. Do you want to meet halfway? Where do you want to meet? Well, halfway. You start walking this way, and we'll walk that way. We'll meet in the middle. On what street? 24th. All righty. I'll, I'll start walking that way, and you walk this way. It'll be All like, right. that, uh, like that, old, that old song, old country song. All right. I like it. All right, I'll cool. see you out there in a minute. All right. Yep. Give me like right. three minutes. Yeah, right, yeah, I gotta put my boots on, put my jacket on. I'll come see ya. All right. And uh, you're, I'm sorry. I'm so sorry. What was your name again? Dwight. Dwight. Yep. Okay. Well, you know my name is Mark. Okay. All right. All right. We'll see you out there. All right. Cool, Mark. Bye. Right. I will see you in a few minutes. Awesome. All right. Bye. Uh, people were saying meet him at the WalMarts. They're saying ask for a ride. He literally lives like five houses down they're not he's not gonna give me a fucking ride to his house he'll pick me up and drive five houses back to his house and be like out the door just yeah just get him out just get him out i don't know why he's trying to poison my son though if i could wingless is over here That's screaming and shit and every, they can't even hear him the only people that can hear him is the audience and us like that guy had no fucking idea oh shit i had no idea Start fucking hacking it up, dude. My, my, some guy knocks on my door while we're doing this. He's like, "Are you fucking okay?" <laughs> oh boy. Calling back later and said I was met by the Walmart on Horse Machine Ranch Road. Should, should call him there. later and be like, "You stood me up, you <laughs> yeah. motherfucker." Yeah. <laughs> Thanks for calling Hart's Roadside. Carmen speaking. Are you in a safe location? Yeah, yeah. I was just letting everybody know that I'm, I'm very, very late for my flight, and that I was going to be leaving the car at the terminal. Okay, let me, do you have your case number, or your rental record? Uh, Yeah, hang on, it's in my glove box. Let me let me go ahead and get that for you. Here, you reach over. Whoa, 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 whoa! Are you okay? Sir? Uh, uh, Sir, are you okay? Where's my phone? There it is. Sir? Uh, hello? Sir, are uh, you okay? I don't know where the rental agreement is anymore. I, uh... Okay, what happened? I, um... I think the car will be fine. Oh. oh. What happened, sir? Are you okay? Yeah. This train came out of nowhere. I tried to beat it. Oh. Oh. Hey, let me see if I can stop. Oh, it started. I think it'll be good. Oh. Okay, move off the railroad track. Yep, yes. I'm backing up. Hang on. Oh, this is a good car. It flipped three times, still, still started back up. 
Um, oh my I don't, god! I don't know where the keys are though. Um, do you have the capability to turn it back on? Like, is there OnStar on this thing? Um, so I need a rental record. I do too. I, um, I, I may, might not have explained this very, very well, but I, I just flipped three times and I had the rental record in my hand and then gravity mm-hmm. took over. Okay. So did the train just hit you? I hit the train. It was already there. That was my mistake, but I have, I got the insurance, so that's okay. Okay. What is your, um, the license plate of the vehicle? I need something to pull up your information. Uh, or hang, do you already hang, have a case? No, hang on. Let me go. Let me go. Hang on. Let me look. Let me get out of the car. Let me see. Um, hmm. Let's see. Sorry. I, oh, oh my leg. Ah, I got a cramp. I got sciatica. Oh, hang on. All right, let me. Um, all right, here's the thing. I don't see the mm-hmm. license plate right now. Where is? It? Hang on, let me look. Um, okay, is there any other way? I don't see the plate. Okay. Did you already call uh, about this issue earlier, or? No, no, no. I wasn't late earlier. I just got a. I got a late start to the day cuz I had uh it's my first time to California and I did a weed dispensary mm-hmm. tour and I just got what what the young the youth call blown out of my fucking mind and so <laughs> I was trying to sober up before I left but apparently I wasn't sober enough cuz I didn't see a big fucking train in front of me Oh my goodness and you, you didn't get hurt? Are you okay, though? I mean, my leg looks like a Chinese spare rib right now, but I think I can walk it off. Oh, my goodness. I, I, I'm, I'm tough. I used to do UFC fighting, and like this happened to mm-hmm. me one, one last time. My name's Anderson Silva, by the way. Um, and I got my leg snapped in half when I was trying to block a kick. And like I that I thought that was crippling, but I thought that he, that rod they put in my leg like this would never again. But obviously the doctor malpractice is going to happen. Right. Oh my goodness. Well, um, I don't know what all I heard or what I heard you screaming. I don't know what happened there, but yeah. I hope you're not. Who would I call about a f- about a future crash? Like if I know I'm going to crash, who would I call and, t- and talk to about that? So you would call roadside. Uh huh. Oh, all right. So I'd call roadside before or after. Probably after. <laughs> okay. Oh, oh yeah. They come clean after. up. The, they I come mean, clean don't... up the mess and stuff. Like, cause there's a there's a mess. There's a headlight hanging out. It looks like like if I, if the car had eyes, it looks like those go- those silly Google glasses. You know, they're they're ta- attached by uh, the springs and then they droop out. You know, like a slinky. Right, it's right. like it's like that. So, yeah, we need to gather information here um, in regards to this accident, but mm-hmm. we need a license plate or a the rental record number. Yeah, see, I don't have either of those because the plate came off. I thought it was secure. Like I didn't check it, but it was there. It was there before this happened. Mm-hmm. So, um, what can I, um, what can I, what can, what can I do? I want to help. So maybe look around, see if your paper's there, your rental record, check your emails. There has to be an, um, uh, something we see that says a rental Email. record. Yes. But I can't find my phone. Oh, how are you talking to me? On my phone. <laughs> oh, <laughs> ah, yeah. like... ah, head injuries. <laughs> They're so fun. Um, yes. Oh, um, I'm on my phone. Great. Let me check. All right. Let me get my Gmail. Log in with Gmail. Um, The train's back! 
Oh my god, move. Get out of the vehicle and move. How often do these trains come through? Oh, that was close. Oh my goodness, are you? The train oh was, God, the, yes. the car was you still on the move. tracks. I was outside. I was checking for the license oh my plate gosh. and my paper, but the train took the car. <gasps> really? Yeah, it's, it's gone. Oh my God. Well, I'm sure glad you got out of that car. Yeah, me too. Like I, my legs already messed up, but I mean, the car could be replaced. I mean, I have great insurance. Oh, I, yeah, I, I got your sure. guys. I got your guys' insurance. I even, I even added an extra driver, but I don't. I don't understand. What's going on. I had the worst luck. This happened in so Hawaii. So you have your phone? In... Really? I happened in Hawaii one time. Yeah, except I, I, uh, I was going on one of those volcano tours. And it wasn't my car though, but mm -hmm. but I was in one of the buggies and they took us to the top and it's they were like oh dormant volcano dormant volcano. And then, like, we got up there and a bunch mm -hmm. of smoke started coming out. So the, the guy got really concerned and we sped down. And then he, he missed a turn like it was one of those dirt shoulders. And we ended up, t like, it went off and it skidded down and we ended up in the ocean. I'm very accident prone. Oh, sounds like it. Oh, my God. Nine lives. I probably used 15 of them by this point. I, I hope I have more. <laughs> I have, yes. poor, I have oh poor. My God, I have. This is so scary. Yeah, I have poor spatial awareness. Like my my mm. depth perception is very off, um, especially when I don't wear my glasses. I have what's called walleye vision. Like it's my mm. depth perception is is very poor. Oh my gosh. Yeah. It's 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 concerning. One day I'll I'll find a woman that that loves me, even though I have a disability. Um. Because I can't tell you the amount of women that I've for like first or second dates I've went in for a kiss and I've accidentally headbutted them and like their nose bleeds. <laughs> oh my gosh! Hey, yeah. Wait a well, second. Yeah, wait, take. Oh, the train's back. Get, Here comes the yeah, car. Get away. The train's just taunting me. Oh my gosh! Yeah, you need to stay away from that trail, the train track, please. You're scared me. I don't be scared. It's okay. I'm. I like I said, I got a broken leg, but but I'll be strong for you. <laughs> you be strong for me. I be strong for you. We'll be together soon. <laughs> I'm walking. I'm walking to you. All your love is all I need. Okay. Did you find your rental record, sir? No. No. Okay. Okay. But I, 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 I do want to tell like you that the, the town? yeah, I'm in town. But I'm gonna tell you the blood's not, the blood's not coming out of my leg, which is thankful. I think it's going somewhere else. Okay. Are you bleeding, or do you need to call nine one one? Nope. Or? Nope. I uh, I found some leaves, and I I used their 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 natural like stickiness to adhere them to my leg. Mm -hmm. I think I'm good. Oh yeah, I know They got the healing powers. Mother Nature take care of me. Yeah. I just get. I just. I think it's because I get spontaneous erections when I'm frightened. That that's why the blood's not coming out of my leg. Mm. That that's it's a it's a it's a self defense mechanism. It's a part of the fight or flight situation, and I choose to fight. I fight for our love. Mm. Okay, so well, we're gonna need a rental record. Yep. Um, before we can do anything. Okay. Can I can I go look for so it and I'll call I'll call you back if if I find it. Yeah, it's recorded, but it's 
Yeah, definitely give us a call back. Roadside is open 24 hours. Oh, no, I'm not going to be able to call you back. I, I yeah, just, you can call us back. No, We're no, open I can't. 24 no, hours. No, I can't. I can't. I just died. Okay, so you need to go ahead and hang up and give us a call back or call 911. I can't hang up. I'm dead. Oh, we have a four plus minute voicemail with oh with the Carlito bond. All right. It's uh the people about the ditch water. Oh good, that we were supposed to meet. <laughs> we didn't. They sound they sound irate. Uh here. This call may be monitored or recorded for training purposes. I, I didn't I'm I didn't, I skipped ahead to here, but I'm i I'm guessing that they start talking any minute now. Good. <laughs> there we go. Hi, who is this? Hi, it's Mark. Where you did just called you me a little bit ago. You were calling from. Huh? It's funny that you should call because my third eldest, Larissa, was talking about it last week. Oh, awesome. Someone did call last week about the same thing, was that you? Uh, no. You you, got, you just called me. She we're was talking the about first your son. In the family to go to university. So we're all really quite proud of her. Uh huh. Oh, that's a good job. So, I'm sorry, you said I your son exactly got sick. Hear you there. So your son got sick. What was that again? You you called Mark and said your son got sick out of the ditch. Could you was say that, that again, place, please? You said your son got sick out of the ditch. Well, you know, here's the thing. Waiting. The last time someone spoke to me on the phone, I got in quite a bit of trouble because, well, my oldest, Rachel, wouldn't speak to me for a week, and that really hurt. And sometimes Aww. these things are really quite important. You know, no matter what it right. is. You there? Well, you know, since you put it that way, <laughs> uh, you've been quite kind to me. Well, but you called me and you had a concern about your son. Do you have a son? Oh, are you still there? I'm sorry. My hearing is not so good. What were you saying again? How about now? Can you hear me now? I'm sorry. I got diarrhea. And you caught me at a bad time. Can you say that again, please? Sure. Well, that does sound good. Yes, yes. You've been quite kind to an old guy like me. Now, Larissa... My third eldest, I believe I've talked about her before. She's quite the smartest and... Right, right. I'm sorry, can you please repeat yourself? The diarrhea is very loud coming out of me. Get out of me, Taco Bell poops. Okay, so are you okay? I'm sorry about your health. Oh, sorry, sorry. What was that again? I said I'm sorry about your health status. My bottom hurts. I had too much Taco Bell and got the meat sweats. Oh, man, I'll tell you what, that that's the worst. Yes, well, you know, I was in the middle of making feces in the toilet when you called, so... Oh, well, okay. I'm skipping well, by as it is with the world economy finances the way they are. No, no, I get it. You got to vote different, right? You got to vote different come November, so... I'm sorry, no, I'm sorry. you're what having you a problem. you were calling from... I'm calling from... You just called me. Hello, hello. Are you there? You know I'm here. I'm uh, sorry, I couldn't bullshit. quite hear you. Uh, you. You know I'm here, but anyway, you called me, what and was that? we're talking yeah. about stuff. You know what? Well, here's the thing. I got in trouble on the phone the last time. My family won't you talk did? to me anymore. So well, I don't blame I have to be a bit more careful on the phone now. Okay. I pooped a lot while you've been on the line with me. Well, that's good. That's good. I'm a, I'm a, a natural laxative. So, pooped anyway. All over the floor. Oh, God, why? Oh. oh, that's just wrong. Can you give me some toilet paper, honey? All right. Well, I'll let you get back to your business. Nice talking to you. Please Appreciate excuse call. me. I need to flush the toilet or my anus is going to meet Taco Bell. <laughs> That's funny. I made a poopy. 
Yeah. I hope you, you don't. I hope you don't. I uh, hope you don't have cancer and bleed out and die. The poop is coming out so fast and sideways. Yeah, oh there, my might, God. there might be cancer there. That would be just wrong. I hope you don't I die. You better call 911. This. Yeah, call 911. I'm sorry. Bye. All right, then. <laughs> there you go. That's the uh, Carlito bot. That's the KLA. I can help you. Hi, you cook steaks? We do. Okay, can you explain to my vegan friend why he should eat a steak. I've been arguing with him all night, and he says I'm wrong, but he says if I can get someone else you to side with me. Wrong, listen, listen, listen. This guy's going to tell you why she... He's a professional. He's going to tell you why you should eat it, why you should eat a steak. Put your tofu down. Well, I'm I'm, I'm, I'm not the professional. I can get you to a professional at no, this moment. No, listen. Don't fuck this up. Tell me you're the professional. Oh, fuck. Hello? Yes, I can hear okay, you. Okay, hi. Um, I, I was just telling the other gentleman that I've been in a uh, uh, an argument with my friend. He's a vegan for about the last half an hour. And he's arguing, saying steak is not nutritious, that actually it'll give you brain disease uh, if consumed. So I I, th I told him, he said he would eat a steak if I could talk to somebody and that you could prove to him and you can, you know, you could reassure him that he will not get brain disease if he tries steak. Um, well, I'm not a scientist or a nutritionist of anything of that matter. But what I can say is that there are definitely more cheaper cuts of meat that are linked and filled with different types of, I don't want to say chemicals, but it's filled with so many different types of hormones that are not good for the body. But specifically at STK, we have very, very fine cuts of some of the best cuts of meat that you can state or meat that you can get. So I can say from a professional standpoint that our cuts are very high grade where we have never had anything linked with something like that. So I can only say that from that perspective yeah see th these aren't artificial intelligence stakes like you keep trying to claim no 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 listen listen here dwight i fucking want a tofu steak but you refuse to cook me one see he's been watching texas chainsaw massacre movies and he's telling me oh see look he won the chi he won the chili cook-off with human meat now he's claiming all the steak in the world is huge just human steak it is. It is. This is not a chat GPT yeah, sirloin, I don't know sir. Too much about that, so. Yeah, he, he claims it's chat GPT sirloins like you guys are printing, like 3D printing artificial steaks in the kitchen. Unfortunately, we are not, no. Um, but if, was there anything I could help you with apart from that information, ah! sir, like a reservation or a Yeah, um, a, a, a reservation, but can we, because he's, he's spurging out a little bit. Um, we, I, I need to put him somewhere where he won't disrupt your other guests. Um, and what I would like to do is to, is to like, I want to tie his arms down to his side and force feed him steaks is what I would really like to do. But I need a secluded area in order to accomplish that. I hear you, sir, but unfortunately, the only secluded area we have is private dining rooms, and you need to place a deposit for those. Okay. Otherwise, everything is going to be on our main floor. Okay, because I want to take a, a good ratchet strap, and I want to strap him to a chair, and then I'm going to plug his nose so he has to open his mouth. I'm going to do it, you know, you know, cartoon style. And then I'm going to take chunks of meat, just big fucking chunks of meat that he can't swallow, so he's forced to chew it. And then I he loses patience. he loses all of his vegan powers. <laughs> Thank you for calling AB Steak. This is Jasmine. How can I help you? Hi, Yasmin. How are you? Hi, I'm doing very well, thank you. How are you? Uh, you know what? I'm I'm doing just fine. How 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 much time before you close? Oh, uh, we close at eleven, but our last seating is at ten o'clock. Okay, I'm hurrying. Me and my I son are in the right car. Back. Yeah, me and my son are in the car. We're on the way. Son, the roll the wheel. The wheel? Oh. Are you okay? Son, where are your socks? They're not going to let us in if you don't have shoes on. Oh, the crash has had the same effect as your mother. 
I don't know what that means. I think they'll still see this if you have a open, open head wound. I think you'll be okay. I don't think they have a no bleeding policy. They serve steak medium rare. Uh, come on. Let's start walking. We're not going to make the last feeding. This is how... Oh, man. Come on, man. Is everything okay? We crashed. We were on our way to the last feeding. Uh, well, somebody needs to read us the last rites. Uh, Dad, my chicken strips. Oh, son, I'm just zoning you. We're going to a steak place and you want chicken strips? <laughs> yes, Dad, I want chicken strips and party mustard. You're adopted. Hi, thank you for calling Hunting Sweet and Chica. This is Wendy speaking. How may I help you? Hi, Wendy. Have you ever heard a grown man and his son crash into a train at 120 miles an hour? Yes or no? Uh, yes or no? Quick. Yes or no? Jesus Christ. She's <laughs> gone. She's <laughs> gone. That's not, that's not really a good thing because she's going to report that number to the police, I oh. think. We have to call back and smooth. I, got, I want to tell her I'm a oh, uh, we're daredevils. Sure mid, we're, wait, hold on. Make sure we're that it's mid uh, crash, okay? Hey, uh, hey, hey, you're evil. Can you, can can you set junior, that up? Junior, yeah, mid crash. Uh, which one? The vocal yeah. ones or the real one? The real one. The, okay. The vocal one's ridiculous. Yep. yep. All right, start okay, dialing because here we go. There we go. Calling Hampton, Santa Rosa. This is Penny. How can I help you? Hi, today? Penny. Me, me, and my son. We're we're stunt men. Um, can you clear everybody <laughs> out of the front of the hotel? Because we're gonna do, we we got a we got, we brought a car in pieces and we put it together on the roof and we're about to do some sick fucking tricks. Hey, I'm yeah, great. Dan, turn it up. Yeah, dude, lay off the horn. They're gonna clear the people. We'll be fine. Go ahead, good, start it up. All right, feels good, doesn't it? Feel that steering wheel, grip it. Yeah. All right. I'm so proud of my son. Look at that barrel roll. So tight. Tight just like his mother. Yeah, I think Come you might in, need then. to go back to trick school. No, no, he landed it. What'd you say to me, woman? He landed it oh, all he four. Landed it? He landed okay, all four. Yep. I'm Evil Evil Junior, 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 okay? Listen, you don't disrespect me, motherfucker. Oh, it still starts? Hey. Sick tricks. That motor yeah, mount is well, awesome. Let's do, the next one. let's do the next one. Do the next what? Mm -hmm. Okay, next trick is we're gonna jump this. Next we're gonna, we're gonna, gonna next trick is we're gonna we're gonna jump this train. We're gonna jump the train off the roof. Sick tricks. Okay. This one's a little slower than the other one. Hang on. And we got the train to safely to platform nine and three quarters. Fantastic. That, that was a really good one. I really liked that one. Yeah, that, wasn't, hey, that, that one was Harry? slow and safe. That was slow and safe. Yes, yes, it was, Harry. Five point landing. Yep. I'd get, I'd get some sex for landing that train yeah, like damn that. It, damn, damn it, Dad, you didn't turn the power up to five. It was on one on the train. Oh. Okay. Yeah, can we, we see uh, five? Yeah, here's, here's five. Just one more time. Here's five on the train. I'm at the train. Oh, shit.
Dude, that's not good. That's open flames right there. Oh, yeah. Yeah, yeah I'm going to be, gonna be I'm gonna be honest, guys. That one, that one's a little weak. Hey, son, yeah, here. Might take, take, no, take the fire extinguisher shirt inside and spray this woman and cool her down. She's overloading her naughty bits. Okay, Dad. Here, here, look. I'm done right now. Let's go well, down. This woman, that, that, no, hey, no, Dad, come on, get, get the elevator. Works. Come on, we're gonna go downstairs. Oh, okay, 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 okay. okay. We're, gonna go, we're gonna go down top okay. of her. This is gonna be your new stepmom. Dad, what if she's ugly? It, it's your stepmom. You're not supposed to fuck. That her. could be. You're not supposed to fuck you your stepmom. Quit watching Pornhub. Hey, how are you at getting stuck inside of a dryer? Face first. <laughs> Uh, honestly, that's a kind of a rookie mistake. Oh, well, how do you do it for reals? How do you get stuck in a dryer? Yeah. Well, you know, depending on what skill level you're at. Like, I'm at skill level at least 60. So. Woo! You're so setting the alarms off. You're getting it hot in here. Woo! <laughs> So, uh, how much? Come on, what, what's the next sound? How, Give me how? the next one on the soundboard. Uh, okay. What's the next one? Okay, all right. Well, I'll play this game. Okay. Um, choose one, two, three, four, five, six, uh, one through ten. Uh, seven. Uh, okay. Let me hit seven. Uh, one, let's see. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. One through ten. 